Imagine a tiny organism, smaller than a single strand of hair, that can survive deadly poisons and produce gold. Sounds impossible? Well, it's real. Meet Cupria vitis metallidurans, the bacteria that literally turns toxic metals into tiny nuggets of pure gold. Yes, gold. And today, we're diving deep into this microscopic alchemist's world. Bacteria are everywhere. Soil, water, even inside your body. Most are harmless, some are helpful, and a few can make you very sick. But this special bacteria thrives in places where almost nothing else can survive, like metal-contaminated soil, toxic industrial waste, and extreme environments that would kill most life forms. And here's the kicker. It doesn't just survive, it converts poison into gold. Scientists first discovered this remarkable bacteria living in highly toxic environments. They noticed tiny gold particles forming in places contaminated with gold compounds, and after careful study, realized that the bacteria themselves were responsible. Through a process called biomineralization, these microbes transform poisonous gold ions into solid, metallic gold nanoparticles. Tiny, invisible to the eye, but real gold. Now, how does it do this? Cupriavitis metallidurans uses specialized proteins and enzymes to neutralize toxic gold compounds. These enzymes, like COPE, detoxify the gold and precipitate it as solid nanoparticles. Essentially, the bacteria take something deadly and transform it into a completely harmless and valuable substance. Imagine turning poison into treasure. That's exactly what these microscopic creatures are doing. The gold doesn't just appear magically. These bacteria live in harsh conditions where toxic metals are dissolved in water. When they encounter gold ions, they process them internally and expel them in a stable, solid form. Over time, trillions of bacteria could produce enough gold to see with the open eye, although it would still be microscopic. It's a process so slow and precise that it feels like nature's own nanofactory. This isn't just a weird curiosity. Scientists are exploring real-world applications. These bacteria could help in sustainable gold mining, removing toxic chemicals from the process. They might even clean up polluted soil and water, detoxifying heavy metals in places where humans struggle to intervene. And in the field of nanotechnology, the tiny gold particles produced by bacteria could be used in electronics, medicine, and scientific research. Tiny creatures, huge potential. Cupriavitis metallidurans thrives where almost no other life can exist. High concentrations of metals, toxic compounds, extreme pH levels, these are death traps for most organisms. But these bacteria have adapted over millions of years. Their cellular machinery not only protects them from metals, but allows them to actively convert these substances into gold. It's evolution at work in the tiniest of forms. Most bacteria are simple. Some help digest our food, others recycle nutrients in soil. But Cupriavitis metallidurans is in a class of its own. While others survive, it thrives. While others consume nutrients, it processes toxins into treasure. This tiny bacterium shows us that nature is not only resilient, but also wildly creative. It's a reminder that even the smallest life forms can achieve extraordinary feats. Here's something mind-blowing. A single bacterium produces only a tiny gold particle, but a colony of trillions? They could theoretically produce a speck of gold the size of a grain of rice. That means that these invisible organisms, too small to see with the open eye, collectively have the power to create something humans value immensely. And all of this happens without any human intervention. Nature's micro-alchemists at work. Why does this matter? Beyond the novelty, these bacteria teach us about survival, adaptation, and the hidden potential of microscopic life. They show that life can flourish in the harshest conditions and even turn death into value. In a world where humans are mining faster than nature can replenish, bacteria like these offer a sustainable, low-impact way to extract precious metals. Tiny but mighty. They are a blueprint for innovation. So next time you think of bacteria, don't just think germs. Think alchemists. Think survival experts. Cupria vitis metallidurans proves that sometimes the most extraordinary things happen at the tiniest scales. From deadly toxins to glimmering gold, these microscopic creatures remind us that the natural world is full of surprises. If you enjoyed this journey into the micro world, make sure to like, subscribe and share to uncover more hidden wonders of life.